Hello and welcome to the Golden Dust Bars Plays Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate. Uh, today I'm going to do a quick walkthrough tutorial for newbies and uh, kind of first timers alike on how to defeat Lao Xin Lung. I think that's how you say it. He is the uh, G1 hub quest, or I think that's what, multiplayer hub quest, urgent hub quest. That's what he is. <laughs> Whenever my team is ready, we can start. But I'm going to be Gunner. I was going to show my items, but we don't have time. But I'm going to go ahead and be Gunner. If you want, you can be Melee. I will explain what to do as Melee as well. I'm going to be Gunner because I'm really bad as Melee. And yeah, at least I'm honest. <laughs> and I, I want to be able to do more DPS as Gunner. So we're starting underground or in the building. Of course, you can grab a map. You can grab some potion. I like to grab some ballista ammo, and I like to uh, take the easy barrel bomb L's. Uh, yeah, looks like everybody got what they wanted. Sometimes people leave things behind. There's a binder in there, two binders that you can use, and they're pretty good, but I don't use them. Oh, I see. I see we got some brainwaves going on. I like to put some bombs down in front so that when Lao comes, he gets uh, hit in the chin with bomb. So first you want to do some damage to his head. You can do that as melee or gunner or uh, archer. And this is good because it should stun him if you do enough damage at a time. Oh, very good. Um, otherwise, if you don't want to be doing damage, say like you kind of want to stand back, you can go over here and there are five ballisto ammos in this um, gathering mode. So the door is over there, so you could quickly jump across past that cannon cannon cart thingy and just come over here and uh, gather five ballista ammos and use the uh, crossbow gunner thingy. I don't know what it's called. And uh, so Lao has like two positions he, he moves with, I guess. He has his back leg movement and his front leg. Uh, back legs is like faster and it's kind of harder to hit him. Front legs is slower, but he can actually damage you uh, more easily when he's like that. Uh, the way he can damage you is if you're attacking his feet and he takes a step, he can kind of smack you aside and it will hurt you. So if you're a gunner, please be careful. If you're low, low armor, maybe it's best that you just do kind of what I'm doing. Just don't get in his way, stay far away. You know, we have our switch axe user there. He's kind of confident. He knows when to attack, when to stop. Uh, so at this point... Oh, where is it? Oh, here we go. We have some... We're gonna fill up the cannon, because he is parallel to the cannon. Each cannon bomb thingy holds uh, three... three bombs. And it can... This thing can hold a maximum of nine. <laughs> I missed. <laughs> but uh, you'll know if you miss or not. Uh, when you hit, it'll have a orange explosion showing that you hit. Wait for me! Yay, we've got six in at least. Yeah, brainwaves! So as we pass by, you can hit them too. Yeah! <laughs> so they had the two, three buttons. They have a middle button, which is shooting button. Left button is to move to left, right button to move to right. Once you he's already passed or you know you can't hit him anymore, you may as well just move to the right. Some people like to um, you know, try to do as much damage as possible, and they'll go like back and forth, back and forth, but I think it's stupid. Uh, right now, he's parallel to the crossbow shooter thing, so he'll destroy it now with his, with his shoulder. You do not want to be standing on that side of him. It's very, very dangerous. You will probably die. At this point, let's see. Oh, it's full. So I 
think. Yeah, I think I could get him. Let's try. Nope, he's too low. <laughs> I was wrong. So I was gonna go ahead and do some damage. <laughs> if he goes forward a little bit more, you can hit him. But for now, I'll just, you know. <laughs> and uh, the parts of his body that you can damage are his head, to each of his front legs, or his front shoulders, and his back. Um, it's easier to damage his back with um, the cannon and, um, oh nice, and things like that. I'm gonna get some cannons. What? Where are they? Oh, it's the next stop. Oops, I just go over here. Oh, cannons right there. <laughs> yeah, there's like a few, a few uh, gathering points for the cannons. Wait for me! Yay, good team player. Always be aware of your teammates. Get a little bit extra damage there. Yeah! I think I'm gonna gather some, some more ballista ammo. I need to just do a little bit of damage to his face. And then I'll grab some ballista ammo when I pass by. And uh, you don't need to worry about being close to his face. Um, I mean, if he's doing that, you have to be careful because his head can hit you and his shoulder will especially hit you. But if you're, you know, away from him or he's just walking, you don't need to worry. He's not going to bite you or anything like that. Maybe I'll go on the other side. Oh, good timing. Ah, so I'm gonna grab some cannons, actually. So this is the, the node on the ground. Um, I know it's habit, but when you're climbing, do not press B to try to, you know, hop up faster or something, because you will end up dropping your bomb. So you gotta slowly scoot up here. And, oh, oh shit. Yeah, and if you if you accidentally walk up onto that, because I was holding R to climb to run, uh, you'll climb on top of that. Do not push B to roll off. You can just run off and jump off. They do a little extra damage there. Oh, that was close. Oh, it, I didn't know you could do that. Well, apparently you can do that, and if you have some um, anti dragon bombs, that's very very nice. <laughs> Maybe after they're looting, they'll set them some, set some down. Yeah. Oh, good teammate. Good job. Nice work. That's my character's. That's my character's voice. <laughs> my my male character's voice. <laughs> good job. Hey. <laughs> yo 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 yo. <laughs> brain waves, brain waves, brain waves. <laughs> uh, this gathering point has 10 uh, ballista ammos, and since I grabbed 5 earlier down below, I you do not want to grab extra, because once you reach, ma reach maximum, it will... Um, it would like be a waste. Um, to my right was a, um, I think it was a Dragonator? I don't know if that's called a Dragonator, but it's like a Dragonator. It shoots a missile, you'll see a target on the ground under him over there. It will shoot right there. So if you time it right, you can hit him like real good. They hit him okay, but he didn't flinch for some reason. Usually he'll flinch. Um, actually, I can show, I, I did this run a few times with these guys. There's a point where I was actually like, in the spot <laughs> and I was very very lucky that my hunter arts let me dodge that so at this point we're gonna start cannoning him
And at this point, he is almost uh, leaving the map. So if you want, you can do a little extra melee damage. You can grab some more ballista ammos. You can do whatever you want. Um, I'll just do a little extra damage on his face. Oh ho ho! Yeah, I think I hit him. <laughs> it looked like I hit the third one, but I'm not sure though. Oh, you can see his shoulder's broken. Some uh, carapace uh, fracturing. His back is also broken. Oh! Yeah, it usually doesn't break until the second phase. I don't know if it does extra damage when it's already broken. I think um, they had the other... Oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> the other person's like, go! <laughs> Let's go to the next area! Yeah, so they're collecting some more of those thingies. I wanted to dive inside, <laughs> but um, I didn't. I didn't get to. Uh, so here, you want to turn the corner and go out. Some people, I notice, they get lost in there for some reason. I think because like they're just like, what, what, where am I? <laughs> so yeah, you just want to just U-turn. And here, you can grab some more ballista ammo. And then um, we have a second, a second. Um, cannon thingy and I think one more no no two in the front here like right right over here we have a bow bow gun thingy and we have one more kind of closer towards the entrance so he's gonna come in soon I believe and uh oh I don't have any bombs I thought I did oh no I already put them down sometimes I carry extra but I just carried two this time I guess so there's cannon there's a uh, bow gun ammo and the uh bow gun is down here where the little crack is. You can just hop. You don't need to, like, you know, spam forward. I'm gonna go ahead and shoot him in the face. Uh, we have our extremely brave uh, lockdown up ahead. Shooting with her with her bow. Paint gunning him. <laughs> I think he, she made a gun in him. Paint gunned him. So at this point, uh, hunters will be gathering the um, ballista ammo preparing the cannon by filling it up or using the bowgun to do a little extra damage. Like here I'm gonna grab a little extra bowgun ammo. I think this one has only five. Yep, just five. kind of risky because he's like just about to hit me so I'm gonna do some damage on his on his shoulder maybe he'll flinch because it's already broken I don't know I actually don't know if you guys know if, if something's already broken and you you attack it does it do more damage now he's gonna go ahead and elbow the bow gun yep I uh, shoot him in the face. Somebody got hurt, I guess. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> so right now is a good time. You want to either be hitting his feet, doing deep da or doing damage, or you want to be uh, up on top of the bridge and prepared to jump onto his back. From his back, you can loot, and then you can put some bombs. I don't know if I'll make it. Oh, I made it. Yeah. So I'm just going to loot his back. As you can see, it's already damaged from earlier. Um, yeah, that that was like... I've never seen someone be able to do that, what, what they did before, where they like... He like elbowed the, the cannon, and then... Um, oh shit, I can't get off. Oh, snap. Do I just get off on the side? I don't know. I want to get kicked or something. Oh, <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Um. Oh, oh, oh okay. Uh, I, I have to get off. Ooh, yo, 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 yo. So he's attacking the other side. What's on the other side? Oh, the other side also has some bow guns. I actually didn't realize that. Oh, nice stun. Oh, oh no! What happened? Was that a stun or was that him attacking? What was that? I don't know. 
Oh, poor Moore. Um, right now is a good time. So around this point, when he's a little bit past the bridge, you will want to be doing, uh, you want to be filling up the cannon and shooting the cannon onto him because he's at the perfect spot. Perfect spot, perfect spot. I believe. Let's see. Yeah, perfect spot. And this would be the perfect time to break his back if it's not already broken. And then we have uh, two people up ahead. You can see they are uh, by the Dragonator, waiting for him to get close enough. Once he gets close, he'll start attacking the castle fort. Oh, there we go. They got him in the face. Yeah. So we are at the three-fourths point. So he should be close to death, maybe. Depending on how well we're doing. So again, we got like the same two hunters. We we kind of, you know, you just want to fill a role. You know, you either want to be, you know, attacking as much as you can, or you want to be using cannons, using bow, or the crossbow thingy. You know, make sure you got a buddy to be with. You know, there's a there's a reason why there's four of us. You don't want one person sitting there struggling, trying to hit the legs and not being able to do anything, or you know, three people doing something that doesn't need to be done. Try to have a pair. So I'm out of out of cannon, so we can go ahead and move. And you see that communication? Ooh, my buddy! Yeah, <laughs> communication. Yeah. <laughs> I love this game. <laughs> All right, so over here is a second uh, cannon. Oh yeah, see there, there he is. He'll he'll do damage um, by swiping his head across the the or sweeping his head. Oh, sweeping his head across the ground. You do not want to be standing there, of course. He will also. Um, I think that's it. I think he just sweeps his head across, and it has a pretty far reach. It doesn't look far, but it's pretty far. So you're going to be wanting to attack his feet, attack his body. Uh, the reason why I'm ignoring the cannons, as you can see, the cannon can't hit. You want him to be stepping back just a little more. Yeah, like right now. Yeah, perfect. Then continue refilling the cannon while our uh, archer does, uh, you know, range damage. And more down there, our melee user does some damage on his feet. Continuously stunning him, using the cannon. You know, we all have consistent damage. <laughs> Even though I'm like rubbing against- Oh, there you go! He's dead! Oh, I didn't mean to do that! I pushed B because I, I, I don't know why. <laughs> but he died. He's dead. <laughs> I can add the death animation from another video if you like, if you want to see what it looks like. And uh, you want to loot around his heart. You'll be able to tell where it is, either you know just knowing where his heart is, or you'll see where his uh, front legs are resting. Um, it will know because four carves are on his uh, belly and four carves are on his, I guess, neck or chest. But if you aim for the heart, you'll get all eight. So make sure you loot optimally because you have a limited time. Oh, look at this beautiful monster. Oh, he's dead with his eyes open. Okay, this that 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 was gonna be my that's my thumbnail. <laughs> Here's my thumbnail with no with no interface. Yeah. <laughs> um, nom 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 nom. <clears throat> professional tutorial walkthrough <laughs> but yeah 
Uh, that's how you defeat him. Uh, let's go ahead and loot. So we got a lot of loot. And the blue loot is usually the best loot, because it's from all the broken parts. If you can read fast enough, it'll be there. <laughs> oh, I got a little charm. Um, I don't need that. 22 minutes. Not bad. And that is how you beat Laoshin... Laoshin... Laoshin Long. I think that's the name. <laughs> Just Lao. So, I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you have any questions, um... Either ask in the comments, someone might help, or I can try to help, or rewatch the video. Hope you guys enjoyed, I will see you next time. Bye bye!